At a ceremony on February 24th at the Boone National Guard Center in Frankfort, Kentucky, Chief Warrant Officer Jimmy Sims took over responsibility as the State Command Chief Warrant Officer for the Kentucky National Guard from Command Chief Warrant Officer Delenn Gibson, coming out of the aviation community as both a rotary wing and fixed wing pilot, has been the Senior Warrant Officer for the state for the last two years. It's like I always tell anybody I meet, you treat people good, they're going to treat you good. So, And that's, I, I think that's what this world's all about. It's what the Guard's all about, too. The change of responsibility ceremony serves to both render honors to the departing Command Chief Warrant Officer and provide official recognition of the transfer of responsibility to the incoming Command Chief Warrant Officer. The symbol of this position is the Officer's Sword. The War Department adopted the Officer's Sword as a rapid way for the soldiers on the battlefield to identify those officers assigned over them. It's my responsibility to take it the next step farther. Uh, Chief Gibson does remarkable things. Uh, we went from uh, having uh, sent all of our students off to uh, schools to bringing in a warrant officer entry candidate program that we started at Wendell Ford where we can train our own people. Newly appointed Command Chief Warrant Officer Jimmy Sims takes responsibility of the Kentucky National Guard Warrant Officer Corps, leaving his previous position as the Senior Maintenance Officer at the Department of Logistics. Command Chief Warrant Officer Sims will take up his new position in Frankfort, Kentucky, continuing the legacy that Chief Warrant Officer Gibson has left.